That's three. Can I get four? Come on, baby. Hello, hello, hello! Gym membership flush. Can I get five? Look at that movement speed. I'm coming for your ass, bro. You think I was gonna leave you alone? Hell no! Kill confirmed! Yeah, you! Yeah, you! You! Right there. So not only are we looking at this beautiful thickness of a creature, Legion officially got buffed and... I have mixed emotions about it because I haven't played Legion in so fucking long, nor have I made a fucking Legion video and I can't even remember the last time I made a Legion video. And I can't remember the last time I said Legion's name. But dude, Legion got buffed and not only... So his buff is weird, right? So since I haven't played Legion in such a long time, going back to Legion and actually figuring out the perfect way to play this character at fucking high level has been making my act- it's been giving me a fucking headache. But I pretty much played Legion, uh, Legion all the way from rank 4 to get back to rank 1. But not only that, this character, when I hopped on this character the first time after he got buffed, this character, not only does- he doesn't feel like a completely different character, but the- you can tell the changes are really, really significant. But there is still a little bit of problems with this character, especially at a high level. And especially since- so, by cutting it short, pretty much Legion's main problem is traversing the map because the maps are bigger than fucking goddamn Alaska. I mean, Alaska's not even that big, but the maps- 80% of the maps are as big as fucking Japan. Or Japan's not that big either. I'm making really shitty comparisons, but the maps are too big for him to be able to use Fire Frenzy super, du uh, super duper effectively, but this character says easy to play, but I think this character should be hard because not only is this character fucking, you have to be ridiculously sophisticated and have an insane knowledge to be able to be successful with this character at a high level, but dude, Legion, you know, when he first got buffed and I played, I'm like, damn, this character fucking sucks. But after playing him a little bit more and figuring out the perfect way to be able to use Fire Frenzy as effectively as I possibly can and figure out the perfect build to be able to use at a high level, not only is Legion maybe the most head, this character will give you a fucking concussion. And not only give you a concussion, he will make you actually work instead of fucking holding that fucking whatever button you use to hold on a gen. But men and women, children of all ages, if you got some popcorns, you got some snacky snacks, you got some cookies, dude. Get that shit ready because not only are we about to hit the sickest fucking kill chains of existence, and trust me, there's gonna be a shit ton of kill chains because if we get a big ass map, Foul Frenzy's about to come in clutch. But nonetheless, kill chains are ready, you're ready, your snacks are ready. Let's make sure we put on a good show. But nonetheless, he's ready, I'm ready. I'm gonna shut up. We're gonna get into the perks. Alrighty guys, now this is what we're rocking, we're gonna spilled for nice legion! So not only is our build, our build, this, getting this build together was actually a fucking nightmare, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. You guys are probably looking at this video like, what is so sophisticated about it? It's tough when you have so many meta perks, and trying to figure out what's the best combination for legion, especially since legion's map pressure isn't generally the best, but this is the most successful build that I was able to find, but regardless, our first perk, corrupt! Intervention! Go to something that in the early game and allows to build early game momentum and you know actually allows to play the fucking game. But not only that, any early game momentum we get with Legion and with Bio Frenzy. Oh no, wait, I gotta fucking I think I gotta sneeze. Basically, any early game momentum that we get with Legion, not only is it gonna come in clutch to make sure we get them injured and be able to pretty much get them to waste time by cleansing the deep wound. And not only if they want to be disrespectful, they're gonna heal a heal, and we're just gonna hit them with Fire Frenzy again. But early game momentum with Legion as it was previously, is ridiculously important because not only is this character more of an early game to late game character, mid game is kind of kind of meh, depending on your gen placements, but Corrupt Intervention gonna come in insanely ridiculously clutch, especially if we can get that early game momentum, and if we get that early game momentum, the steamroll effect is about to come in clutch. But then our next perk, which is an essential when playing Legion at a high level, Thanatophobia! So not only is it going to reward us for hitting multiple targets with Fire Frenzy, while well, basically going to reduce their time to working on gens if we're able to use Fire Frenzy effectively, and the more people injured, the more they're going to want to heal. And if they want to heal, that's more time they're going to have to waste. And if they waste time, Fire Frenzy just going to come and clutch again and make them waste even more time. But Thanatophobia, absolutely essential when playing Legion. Corrupted or Vegit, less essential, but if you are playing Legion at high MMR, definitely use Thanatophobia because if you don't, you're pretty much wasting... Uh, 
Fire Frenzy. Fire Frenzy is the only reason why you should be using Thanatophobia on Legion. And I can't think of any other character at a high MMR that you'd want to use Thanatophobia on besides Legion. But then our next perk! Pop goes the Weasel! Gonna be our main guaranteed regression tool and especially gonna come in clutch, ridiculously, uh, ridiculously clutch in the late game, but sometimes maybe in the early game if we can get any sort of momentum. So Pop Goes the Weasel is gonna be our game, our main guaranteed regression tool. So I've been using uh, Scorcher Pain Resonance and fucking Deadman Switch for so long, but on this character, Deadman Switch and Pain Resonance doesn't really work that well since you have to use multiple perks to make Legion viable at a high level. Especially with our last perk, that kind of takes up another perk slot. So not only is Pop Goes the Weasel going to be our quick main guaranteed regression tool, and since the majority of people are going to be injured half of the time, if we can get that quick and easy down, especially quick and easy two downs, that's 50% regression on a singular gen. When you play Legion, you have to worry about singular gens. You can't worry about hitting multiple gens that are all the way in fucking Alaska. It's almost impossible to do it with Legion since his map pressure isn't the best. And his mobility is kind of lackluster, so you're not going to be able to use Pop Goes the Weasel on multiple gens around the map, uh, around fucking across the map. So you're mainly using Pop Goes the Weasel within like three to four gen facility. If you, your gen placements have to be ridiculously clutch, and you have to have the knowledge to be able to figure out what gens you want to keep for mid to late game, because that's when Pop Goes the Weasel is going to be the most effective. And I hope everything I said just makes absolutely sense. I, I hope it makes sense. If it doesn't make sense. Fuck. <laughs> but then our last perk, which is another insanely clutch perk and one of the essentials when using Legion. Sloppy Butcher. So not only is it going to take them longer to heal, they also change, what did they change, uh, the way the hemorrhage status effect works. So it increases, uh, increases the rate at which healing progress is lost from hemorrhage by 25%. So pretty much not only is it going to take them longer to heal, but if they, let's say they're mid-heal, right, and I, they hear my terror radius and they start running away, not only is their fucking healing progress gonna regress, that's ridiculously clutch, especially if somebody's using either self-care or the nerfed Boon Circle of Healing, which is, this perk against Boon Circle of Healing not only will make survivors regret putting that perk on, but it's ridiculously clutch. You compare this, if you had a more mobile character with a high terror radius, you could definitely, you could actually, Doctor wouldn't be too bad either. You could run Sloppy Butcher with, uh, uh, what the, oh, there it is, what is it, Colrophobia? You could run Sloppy Butcher with Colrophobia, especially if you know they're going to be rocking a uh, Boon Circle of Healing, but in casuals, you're never going to know unless you're playing tournament. But Sloppy Butcher, going to come in ridiculously clutch, and with that extra added effect, it's going to be another thing the survivors have to worry about. But then our add-ons! Mural Sketch! Increase the speed bonus per hit during Foul Frenzy to 0.3 movement speed. So not only when we get a hit with Foul Frenzy, we get... So the base movement speed of when we get a hit with Foul Frenzy is 0.2. So every time we hit a survivor, we're getting a plus 0.2 movement speed while we're in Foul Frenzy. So if you do the mathematical equations in your head, 0.2 plus 0.3 is 0.5. And if we're able to hit four survivors with Foul Frenzy, not only are we getting a 2% bonus movement speed increase... But hitting that fifth survivor to get that one shot down is going to be ridiculously easier. It's going to be close to almost impossible, especially against high MMR survivors, but it's going to be quick, easy, and if we're playing a small map, it's going to be fucking terrifying. But then our next add on Mischief List increases the duration of Foul Frenzy by two seconds. So not only are we getting a 2% or what the fuck, a two second increase of Foul Frenzy. With the bonus movement speed, so the main problem with Legion is that his duration of Fire Frenzy still is not enough to put him at, I don't want to say top tier, I hate using tiers because it also depends on the person playing the character, but to make him more, um, how do I explain it? The main problem with Legion, especially at a high level, is that duration is not long enough, even with the bonus movement speed, to be able to get the maximum potential out of Foul Frenzy, and it makes it very, very situational. So, in my opinion, I think this change is a good change for him, but it's not enough to make him ridiculously viable at a high level, nor, like, convenient at a high level. You'd, I'd, you'd rather play something a little bit easier, because you really do have to work your ass off to make this character work. And it's really rewarding, but I think the two-second increase, this add-on should be a part of his base kit to make him more, um... 
I, I don't know if friendly is the word to use at a high level, but if, to make it more convenient to play at a high level to be able to be a little bit more successful. I just think his duration right now is not fast enough, but maybe that was what their intention. But having that increase two seconds is not only a, the key ingredient to be able to connect our kill chains, but it's also map dependent. But that two seconds is such a big deal that it's, it's fucking through the roof insane how big of a deal to have that extra two seconds with that movement speed. It's going to be ridiculously convenient to be able to traverse the map and get those hits easy. But then our offering, Faint Reagent, slightly thickens the dark mist. Alright Legion, you beautiful son of a bitch. Oh, you're ready. I didn't even have to ask you if you're ready. I haven't played you in a bit. But just because I haven't played you in a bit doesn't mean I don't love you to death. I have my fucking... My header is made because of you. And we have so many memories down the line. And I think it's about time since you got buffed. And I apologize for not playing you for so long. But I think it's about time we create some more memories. Create some more kill chains. Get some more one shots. And show people to not only not sleep on you at a high level versus a good Legion. But let's fucking tear this shit apart. Let's create some more memories. But nonetheless, you're ready. I'm ready. I'm gonna shut up. We're gonna get into this shit. Wreckers Yard! Auto Haven Wreckers. Auto Haven, so Wreckers Yard with Legion is actually not that bad. This map's pretty decently small too, dude. I've been getting so many DCs. What the fuck, I just saw somebody stick us. Yeah, I got so many DCs, you'll think I'm playing fucking pre nerf spirit. Momentum? Hold up. You are not gonna to drop. Behind me. Oh, there's two of you guys. Hold up. Two for the price of one? Did fall for it. That's one! Can I get two? Holy shit, that was max range. It's gonna jump over. Pulse? Go. Boy! That's two! Can I get three? Holy shit, I might be able to get four here. Hold up! Come on, come on, come on, come on. I need that momentum. She's waiting. It's, I did insta drop. That was risky for her. Break the shit. Boop. Boop. I'll take that pal though. That's a really decent pal too early game. Boy, there's somebody else here too. I'm on Fire Frenzy again. Are you gonna insta drop me everything? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Somebody's healing. Somebody's on my left foot. What's somebody on? What the fuck? Alright, we're really gonna do that? Alright, potted plants flush. I feel like reading you like a Christmas book. Did have dead heart. And you is! That's one! Can I get two? Jump over. I might be able to get two here. This is risky as fuck. Oh, I am gonna get two! Go back. That's two! Can I get three? Kill chains! Kill chains! I love kill chains! That's three! Can I get four? I'm gonna go back to Pot of Plants Flesh since this guy's gonna disrespect. I might be able to down this guy, to be honest. Come on. No, I'm not. Oh, I could've hit her. Pot of Plush. Oh, whoa. Nice dead hard. Waited for me. She's playing position. Hmm. Jump over again. That's one. Can I get two? Oh my goodness. This is the one thing I love about Legion. Watch your back. Dead hard. That's two. Can I get three? Hmm. One down is all I need to succeed. Three. Can I get four? Come on, baby. Hello, hello, hello! Gym membership flush. Can I get five? Look at that movement speed. I'm coming for your ass, bro. You think I was gonna leave you alone? Hell no! Kill confirmed! Kill chain complete. And I'll take my tags and take that pop boost of Weasel proc. Get up, uh, homeless flush? I don't even know. Get a mo compare the price of death. This is a momentum. I'm surprised this guy didn't try to flashlight. And I know he's around here somewhere too. Working on this gem? Not on this gem. These guys are around here somewhere. And I got a pop quiz with Weezer Prox up. They are on this gem. What the fuck? Hey, Paul, Pat. Wait, hold up. What the fuck? Yeah, you can't flashlight me and do some fucking weird shit like that. Alright, Potted Plants Flesh. I'm concerned for your own health, but I might be concerned for uh, for mine. Get up, uh, Potted Plants Flesh. I keep on forgetting your name. Yeah. They're on that gen? Oh, wow, this is fucking perfect, dude. Not on this gen. What gens are they working on right now? Get a low compare the price of death. Oh. 
And I break this pallet. They dropped me two really good pallets. Imagine if they didn't drop me that pallet right there. I mean, who would've knows? I probably would've got a fifth down. To be honest, a fucking a five-hit kill chain. This is a really, really, really fucking solid map for Legion. Didn't run over here. I feel like... Hmm. Did run back. Should I five-hit kill chain these guys? Somebody's on my left as well. Wait, there's no pals over here. Whoa, 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 gym membership flesh. What are you doing, girl? Dead on? Nah, you're just gonna take me on a ride. And I got the keys to it. Oh. Get up, gym membership flesh. This guy didn't stop to try to flashlight? Interesting. This hook is right here, too. They probably are on that gen. I need to start pop goes, uh, going to weasel this gen. Or these gens. But I might five-hit kill chain here. Get him looking for the price of death. So I know that chick's on my right, but if I can... Kill chain. Hold up. I might not need a kill chain. I'm gonna get this belt. Break the shit. Oh, oh. He's waiting. Hello! That's one. Can I get two? I want that thick flesh to go back for this guy. This is risky. Not so risky anymore. You have dead one? That's two. Can I get three? Thick flesh is gonna go back. Not gonna go back. Is she gonna go back? Did go back. Hello, thick flesh. That's three. Can I get four? These guys are weird. Come on. Hello! You have that one? Did I have that one? Can I get five? Oh no, 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 thick flesh. You thought I was running away? You need to pay the price of death. Kill confirmed. Yo, these guys want to disrespect Legion? I got you, bro. Get up, thick flesh. Boop. Our momentum is so hot. These guys are gonna fucking. I might get another DC, dude. <laughs> Yo, Legion is so fucking nasty. I love this. I'm loving this character even more now. All right, the question. Did gen tap? Did gen tap? Get him out compared to the price of death. Pop goes the weasel. Boop. I'm telling you, you put in the work for this character, it's gonna pay off. Boop. Boop. God. Bro, I did not think our momentum was gonna be this fucking hot. And they keep on mending themselves. They need to stop because I'm gonna keep on getting these five hit kill chains. And they better not go for the heal either, because I'm still gonna go for a kill chain, even if you are injured. Bro, that's the one thing I love. Hello? Jump over. Whoa. That's one! Can I get two? I have an idea. I want you to instant drop. Thank you! Two. And then I'm gonna go back. Three. Go back. Hello. Into drop. They didn't miss a drop. No, you're dead. No, she doesn't look behind her. There's no powder either. Oh, there's a window? No window. You're dead. Oh, she tried 360 my ass. Kill confirmed. That guy's gonna go back on that chin. I could easily get gen rush right here. Mm, hopefully. No, they did finish that gen. What gen could they be on? Get him out compared to Price of Death. That guy's dead too. Hold up. Potted pant? Somebody's over here. We're on that gen. They're double on that gen. That thick flesh is one shot too, so somebody's gonna die here because I know. Bo Whoa! We're uh, having a disco, disco, party, party? Nice dead arm. Instant drop. What the f- Why did Potted Plants Flesh die right there? <laughs> what the fuck just happened? <laughs> Dick Flesh is on my right. Hello, hello, hello. Hold on, where the fucking Disco Disco Party Party will lead you? I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'm gonna be genuinely honest. Bro, that chick dead hearted and this guy got a fucking axe to the face. Get him out to pay the price of death. Why are we panicking staring at mannequins? What the fuck? Pop goes the weasel? Oh. God, look how much we have in fucking brutality, dude. This guy's playing position. Nope. Kill confirmed. Boop, boop. And Thick Flesh is going for this guy, right? If she runs away... What the fuck? You got a flashlight, love! Flashlights don't work! Oh, you're dead. Dead one? Wait! Boop, boop. 
That was weird. <laughs> I don't even know what I said right there. Uh, get up, homeless flesh. Oop. I dude, I didn't even have a chance to give you a name, bro. Our momentum in the early game, and the fact that they wanted to disrespect me by mending right in front of my face, we made them pay the price of death. This game's over. I don't think we're gonna get a merciless face smash though. Ooh, ooh. Get up, thick flesh. Bro, when I tell you, I've been getting so many fucking DCs, it's been absolutely through the roof. I, oh, whoa, whoa. No, my hopes are close. This chick's not moving. I was gonna say, dude, I've been getting so many DCs. I think people are just sick and tired of facing this character, to be honest. This game's over! Bro, I. Now, starting to second guess, is this character really good? <laughs> I, again, it's map dependent since we got a really flat map that doesn't really have anything to manipulate and the map's not too big either. This might have been the perfect map for Legion. Hold on, I'm gonna need to get more brutality. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, this might be Legion's perfect map. Ruthless killer! Yeah, I knew for a fact we weren't gonna be able to get a Merciless. We didn't get enough hooks. Did we get not get enough hooks or was our chaser not enough? Almost got a perfect game, like, yeah, we didn't get enough hooks. Yeah, we didn't get enough hooks. What's everybody using? Saboteur, Spine Chill, Dead Heart. How many Dead Hearts? One Dead Heart, two Dead Hearts. One Adrenaline, Vigil, Prove Thyself. I don't, I don't even think these guys were Survivor Friends either. You got destroyed. And you failed. We'll get him next time. Alrighty guys, well that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really freaking appreciate it. If you like this video, please like and sub. And don't forget to hit that notification button to get notified when I upload. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter whenever you guys want to get notified uh, when I upload. I usually post it on there. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. Tomorrow, we're 100% playing Ghostface again, because not only did he get... I think he got... Uh, did he get a bigger buff than Legion? I don't know if it's a bigger buff, but his add-ons are really good. Ghostface add-ons are so fucking good, and that might make him... In my opinion, that makes him fucking not super good but that makes him pretty decent at high mmr still has the same problems with uh map pressure but dude those one shot consistent downs and the stealth buff is fucking ridiculous but hopefully you guys enjoyed guys i haven't played legion in a bit so after this buff i might actually play him a little bit more this was so fucking fun this was ridiculously fun but nonetheless guys hopefully you guys enjoyed love you guys and i will see you guys tomorrow goodbye and good night